what's different from uh, between now and um, back then when um, SPFSC was not done yet, it's um, it makes life for teachers much more easier because we we know what to teach the students, and it's not based on quantity as much as quality. So we we can we can measure the students' um, cognitive thinking and. Um, we can see how well their brain develops as they they begin from a very basic idea right to when it's expanded and extended. So coordinating the SPFSC exam, that's that's what it's like. The experience is it's much better now. The so the SPFST, um, the, the national assessments, now they, they're also adopting the SPFSC uh, assessment level, but how it was different to it before, um, that's it. The SPFSC assessments, they measure more quality now of our students' knowledge, which is much better because now we get to, to actually see the students for their, the potential that they have. We don't see in how much how many things they know, it's we see how, how they can expand an idea. So once they start again, so when they start with something simple, they know how, how to get into its complexity. That's what's different with SPFSC, which is, which is very good. Um, so, what SPFSC has given these students was the ability to uh, extend into um, beyond the limits of their knowledge. So what they take with them after SPFSC into university is, is the skill of analyzing and critical thinking, which is something very important that um, university, well, any university needs from, from children especially when they leave um, secondary school. So the great benefits of SPFSC programs is students get to delve into the unknown. So when they reach university, they already know how to criticize, they already know how to analyze, they know how to discuss, um, and they do presentations, and everything will be made easier for them, especially with the part where they have to develop thinking and innovate, those are the things that they get with them.